education of children in the Forney area precedes the history of the town by some 20 years. Children in the Forney area were either taught in private homes or attended one of the county schools that operated on private tuition. But on December 6, 1899, the community of Forney voted to establish the first independent public school district. The 147 voters were determined to invest in the education of all of Forney's children, and the Forney Independent School District was established. This 120th anniversary of Forney ISD allows us to pause and reflect on the history of our school district, celebrate our present achievements, and imagine the opportunities for the generations to come. When I walked in, I saw this gym. I said, yep, this is the gym. We graduated from this, from this, from this facility in here. When you walk in the door and you hear the first little creak of the wooden floor, stepping up these big steps that everyone sat on, everyone played on, everyone visited on, parents came and watched games, all those memories, just, just great. When I drove up out here, all of us, everybody had their spot where they stood out here on the, on the grounds. And it brought back so many memories. My best memories are probably in this gym because we had sock hops. It made us all bind together. It was just a lot of fun. My mom gave me a box the other day of stuff and she saved everything. And it was amazing just going back through and looking at that and saw pictures of graduation night and I still remember hanging out with my buddies on graduation night and all of us that were going to go to A&M we sat there and huddled up and pointed towards College Station. Just the school itself, the memories up and down the halls, the friendships we made and we're still, we were a class of 44 and we're still very close. Well this basketball court played a million basketball games here. The football field behind it, the coaches, the uh, teachers and this school brings back a lot of good memories. Every year they always at homecoming they had a bonfire. They had a uh, competition between the seniors and juniors just to build the biggest nicest you know bonfire and you got a reward you know for building the bonfire and so I remember our junior year uh, <clears throat> building the bonfire and and stacking it up and keep building it and it's unusual for juniors to win and we won the bonfire award that year so that was uh, kind of a neat thing that the whole class, you know, came together to do that. Some of my best memories of 1969, my senior year, was um, being cheerleader, um, being in sports. Uh, I was class president. I loved that year. Uh, it makes me want to cry because I can't believe it's 50 years. Um, but uh, this was a very special place. I was really proud that when I graduated, you could um, earn, or when I was in high school, you could earn an advanced diploma instead of just a regular high school diploma by taking extra math and science. And so I took the extra math and science. And so it made me feel it wasn't, you know, that it wasn't just a regular high school diploma, that it was advanced. So. I remember my first day of my freshman year vividly. It was 2009 in August. Um, I was a bright-eyed, eager freshman, just excited, but also nervous because it was the first year of a brand new school. And so this place was really small, a lot smaller than it was today. The building was the same size, but it was only 500 kids versus 2,000. It was small, classes were small, you got to know each other well. And so that was just, my memory was just the small family atmosphere. It was a pleasant experience, number one. You know, it was small. Everybody knew everybody. Uh, we had a very close-knit class. Looking back, I took it for granted that it was just like an extension of your home. It was, I mean, yes, your teachers were your teachers and your mentors, but you still had a relationship with them to where you could go to them if you needed to. Well, Forney IST back then was uh, much smaller. I felt like I knew everybody. Well, coming to school in 40 ISD is really welcoming. Like, it, I've been here for so long, it feels like family. I guess everybody has like that patriotism to Forney. 
like everybody sticks together and everybody's like a community and a family basically. I think overall the atmosphere is really great. I think uh, again the idea of just letting us love on these students and, and, and really take heart of what they want and the, their interests and their needs and really just gearing our lessons towards that I think has been really powerful. It just seems like a really small community and it just makes me feel like I'm at home. You know, everybody just feels like one big family. I go to different schools or go visit somebody and, you know, they're in Forney ISD. It just feels like we're all together, you know, just as a whole. It just feels really nice. Having the opportunity for our students to be able to explore and be very creative has really drew me to Forney. Unlike other districts, um, just being able to do some just wild and, and adventurous things has been so phenomenal. For, for me as a teacher and for our students. The new uh, tracks that they have at the high school that they're able to, you know, really get experience in what they want to do or become uh, at such a young age is um, amazing. Well, right now, mostly engineering, get the work done, learning how to like manage time, following the teachers, listening to the teachers, paying attention if you don't have those you're not going to succeed. I enjoy both engineering and dance. So I'm on the drill team. And um, so basically, engineering has really helped me to be more, like, think differently. And dancing has helped me to open up and have more opportunities. So when I do go to college, I have dancing opportunities, and I'm hoping to go for engineering. My opinion, of Forney ISD really helps out my game and your students a lot of encouragement to do what they want to get done without giving up and honestly there's nowhere else to rather go except for any ISD. My advice would be to learn all you can you know because you never want to get to the point to where you know everything because then it's over you know you don't have anything else to learn so even in my age now I try to learn something new every day. I think the legacy that I want to set is I want to be known for loving and investing in my students. And I'm excited because I've already had kids that have already graduated and came back and have talked to me. And like 10 years down the line, when I'm just seeing the great things that my kids have done. Well, I want Forney to be a, uh, a school district that people want to be in. The school district that, that draws people in or that people talk about and say, hey, they're doing things right. You know, they're looking out for the kids. They're doing stuff that they need to be doing. Uh, that's kind of my aspiration for this district is to be one of the best in Texas. Well, I think that the district right now is really focused on the students. The teachers that's here today really care about their students. We value education. We never become stuck in our ways, that we continue to move forward and that we get everybody involved in it. So I think, you know, Forney Family was an amazing thing. Well, enjoy your time here. Learn the values. Make your friends. Keep your friends. There's nothing like old friends. And learn everything you can because you're our future. Do whatever it is you want to do. And there isn't any limit or restrictions as to uh, what limit you can reach. We just keep growing. And as long as we can support the uh, Forney ISD, I think this legacy will just keep living on. People know that name, they know Forney, and uh, yes it's grown, but when we come here, and especially coming in this building, we still have that feeling, uh, coming home. It's like coming home. As we reflect on 120 years in Forney ISD, there's so many traditions that we want to stop and honor, but also continue. We also want to take time to celebrate the incredible successes of all 12,000 students within our school district. We also want to ensure that the relationships that we have built here in Forney ISD continue on for the next 120 years, and that we are preparing our students to be future ready and take on any challenge that comes their way. <laughs>